was was seem to be causing ripple effects across different strides and of course as we witnessed staffers in his very own office sent to compulsory relief that is with immediate effect as well this comes as reports emerge that Kashagwa whose fate now lies with the courts has hid or has had his security detail as well heavily adjusted that is to a lower level let's take a look at the story that has been compiled by Chichi Josephine the Senate has resolved to remove from office by impeachment His Excellency Rigathi Gashagwa AGH, the Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya. Accordingly, His, Ex His Excellency Rigathi Gashagwa AGH ceases to hold office. A proclamation that came as the beginning to the end of Rigathi Gashagwa's grip on power as a Kenya's second in command. <laughs> and just hours later, this internal memo signed by the principal administrative secretary at the office of the deputy president Patrick Mwangi directing 108 staffers at the office to proceed on compulsory leave with immediate effect. The decision follows ongoing constitutional proceedings related to Gashagwa's impeachment. In the memo dated October 18th, the directive affects all officers in job groups T and U. Mwangi also instructed all heads of departments to appoint responsible officers to oversee their respective departments during the leave period. These developments coming just hours after Parliament approved the nomination of Kithure Kindeki as Deputy President, bearing all the markings, the kick-starting of a transition process. It is a move that has robbed lawyer Lempa Suyanka, who says he is planning to challenge it in court. Mwangi also instructed all heads of departments to appoint responsible officers to oversee their respective departments during the leave period. All of these happening as Gashago remains confined at the current hospital for the third day where the glaring scale down in the security detail was evident. And today, reports that his security at his Mathura home has also been scaled down. His security must be returned because we know that they had already withdrawn. But we have a sitting deputy president, although he's actually in hospital. But even in hospital, we urge that that security arrangement... Honorable member... Chichi, Josephine, TV 47. Allow.